Whoa! <laughs> okay. What's up everyone, it's your favorite blind chick back on your screen with another one, I promise. This will not be a kitchen vlog. I won't be up in here all week. And yes, I am wearing a whole dress. Don't know if it's in the frame, but I'm going to film a video and I wanna make it a thing where I wear a dress, even though you only see like this much. I just think because the world is so closed, it's nice for me to wear all my clothes, you know? Also, uh, why is that such a struggle? The world is supposed to be opening up next week. Not tomorrow, but the following Monday. So, the hit, the hit. I'm gonna make a smoothie first. I soaked my spinach to make sure it's clean. I need my blender. I haven't seen this in two years. You don't even wanna know what it is because then you're gonna be like, what? Girl, why do you have this? Did I really need an iced tea press? I'm over here suffering with this old blender. You know, oysters are really good, or oster, or however you pronounce it, but this one is on his last leg, so <laughs> about that. Remind me at some point, I need to put my fairy lights on the balcony, because it is hot, hot. If I wasn't filming, I'd be out going for a walk with my mom and my auntie, because I think that's what they're doing right now. And last Sunday's walk was so nice, and more of my time with family. It's ironic because today's video is going to be about family and I hope when you see it you love it as much as I think you will since it's part of a series that you've been liking a lot recently. That note, I should also say if you like these vlogs because I asked you guys in a poll on the community tab and the vlogs won by a lot, make sure you tap the like button and comment just so the algorithm knows and this can grow because from the way I see it in the algorithms, well not the algorithms, but the analytics in the background, it doesn't seem like you like this that much. It actually looks like the skincare does better on my channel. Meanwhile, my skin has been doing much better since I stopped reviewing random products, but that's another story. Some of this. Some of this. Water. Okay, so boom, that's my new favorite phrase. Meanwhile, I'm over here crying in the video, like, am I okay? Clearly not. I <laughs> just finished filming that video I told you about. I need to turn back my fridge on. I'll do that after, because it's gonna be in the background of this video, and I'm gonna be happy with that. So I'm not gonna edit tonight, but Lord, I really hope when I do edit it that I don't get emotional, because it's, mm, yeah, you'll see. I'm going to bake the cookies, that I haven't made from two days ago. And you're only supposed to leave in the fridge for 24 hours. Otherwise it dries too much, but it'll spread more. Maybe it'll still taste good. Who's so? Who knows? We'll find out today. It's always a science project. And then from there, I don't know. Hopefully you can hear me. I finally got out. It's very breezy. And I'm listening to another good podcast. What can I say? There's nothing to complain about. It's the little things. It's funny because I remember last night, the guy I was out with was saying how when he goes for his walks, he's so bored because it's the same walk every day. And I just, I think it's because I can't see well. I'm always looking to see what I can see and really take it in. So one day if I end up having a white cane or I can't see as far as I could yesterday, at least I know that once upon a time I appreciated as much as I had. It's a lot quieter than I thought it'd be on a Sunday. Never took in all this time that this is a maze. <laughs> And a waiting pool. I used to work at a waiting pool. It was one of my first jobs. I think I was 17 when I started working there. So I had a couple jobs before then, but they don't make them like that anymore. It's definitely a thing of the past to see anything larger than a splash pad here in Toronto. Don't mind the fridge. Uh, that was such a good walk. I can't believe I was gone for more than an hour. It didn't feel like it. Put a candle on because this is fragrance enough. 
They didn't spread as much as I thought they would. Next time I'm gonna push them down. When you're in a reach for utensil and you're too lazy to, so you just rather take the chance of burning yourself, that's what type of time I'm on. Okay, find your stability. Use your core and your toes. Oh, 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 oh. And slowly lower your hands down to the floor and step the back foot into the ground. Is this man for real? I can hear him shouting. Hot thing, hot thing. I'm the only person on the sidewalk, so even though I can't see him. Well, good morning, guys. It's Monday, and this is the first Monday. Can you even hear me? <laughs> this is the first Monday in months that I woke up in the best mood. I think it's because summer is around the corner. Like, it's 25, feels like 31. This is my kind of temperature. I'm just heading to the supermarché right by my house because I want to make a smoothie, but I ran out of spinach. So I'm like, let me just grab it real quick, even though this grocery store is hella expensive. Look at these prices. I told you it wasn't cheap here. Dang, the bandits got all the chips. There was definitely parties going on this weekend. Oh my God, I just want a tortilla chip. Clean up this a bit so that at least when I do the film part, it doesn't look a hot mess. Okay, I definitely want some of this as part of my really, 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 really late breakfast. But okay, this. You know you're Caribbean when you say you a lot. Whoa. Milk. I always say it wrong, just like I say it oven. I say oven. Uh, and my mom always says comfortable. I'm like, mom, it's comforter or comfortable. Comfortable. Okay, Caribbean lady. This is how I get my vamp. Ooh, there's literally nothing left. I'm outside. This is insane. This is my type of temperature. I'm gonna put the light outside. up but it's cute no especially at nighttime i think it's gonna be so nice once i figure it out properly question how bright is bright answer bright bright it's so cute it's actually really pretty Doing what I gotta do to pay the bills. One fifty twenty nine. The rain sounds so peaceful. I love me a good gloomy rainy day. Am I a weirdo for that? I don't know anyone else who loves the vibe. I mean, I don't want this every day because otherwise I'd live in the UK. But every once in a while, it's just the perfect mood. As a legally blind person, there's no glasses you can get for under $300, so it wouldn't be any better with the... I'm very sorry. Let's just have a little powwow. Wait, let me set up my camera because it's going, it's going to take a minute. This is the part where I get so annoyed with life. So what happened was, since you probably don't even know from that phone call, is I called in because I was like, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. The price is not right on my most recent health statement. They gave me $200 and I'm like, uh, I don't know much math, but what I do know is 345, 80% of that is 270 something, not 200 even. So I did da, 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 on the calculator and I was right. I'm like, okay, so maybe I do know some arithmetic. And I called them up to be like, hey, where's my 76? Run me that. Cause I've already had issues with this insurance company in the past. Then what you heard is when I asked to be transferred, so I'm like, maybe it's because I have group benefits with my company. What if I just do this solo individual thing? I'm not here to bash people who get plastic surgery. It's just a perfect example because I can go out and build a body. I can get my boobs done, get a nose job, get my teeth fixed. I can even get different colored eyes, but I can't fix my eyes. And I just don't understand how I live in a world where I can fix my appearance, but I can't actually correct my vision, which to me, and again, this is no offense to anyone who's ever gotten anything done. If you like it, I love it. But I'm just saying for something that matters to me, like being able to function day to day, to live the life the way I did for 21 years before this disease is impossible. What a long shower. Ow, what's going on with me today? A long shower and a little bit of effort. 
Here we are, we're back again. I have all this clothes and nowhere to go. It makes me feel stupid for all the times I bought stuff. I mean, I'm going to do a no buy summer because there's literally nothing I need and skirts like these I haven't worn in at least five years. So no hauls from me, at least until the fall, if, if at all. So she was, what I just complained to you about? That ain't working, so. Speaking on that, I have to readjust my spreadsheet. I have a spreadsheet of budgeting. I won't talk about it much because I'm sure it's boring, but trust me, that's how I stay on track and I'm able to travel. Kiwi. It's good. How is it nine o'clock on the dot? That means I've been editing for about four hours, which is insane because as soon as I wrapped up work, I started editing. I said, I'll give myself two hours and then I'll be done. No, no, no. It was a long vlog, I hope you guys enjoy. You know what to do when it comes out. Tap the like so the algorithm knows to keep putting it out. I'ma head out, cause I think I earned a little snack. I'm gonna get me some Rudy's. I'm super hyped for that. And I think I earned it as well, considering that my course has arrived. So mask on. It's a Rudy's, you know I love this burger spot. Best burger in the city, hands down. It may not look like much, but let me tell you, if you visit this city, if you're from this city and you don't try this burger, unless you're vegan, of course. That morning light, it's so pretty. Would you believe I woke up at 4.19 this morning? Nope, that's not mascara. Because it wouldn't be a day in my life if something didn't fall. It's the weirdest conundrum. I want to look forward to the future. Actually, when I was a kid, all I ever did was look forward to the future. I'm just trying to wake up, especially when I wake up early like this, like I got an hour before I start my shift. I just want to be as grateful as possible because if I know anything about last year, nothing is guaranteed. Hey, Mother Nature casting the light right on me. I just got to do my brows and then I'm done. Remind me. Actually, you don't even have to remind me because I'm going to pack it right now. Advil. These cramps killing me oh my gosh i didn't even tell you guys the weirdest dream that i had this morning part of the reason why i woke up at 4 19 is i had a dream that i brought a box from one of my old, old houses to where i live now and i was unboxing it which is weird because i've been living where i'm living for three years so uh, i love when the sun comes in like that anyway long story less long because you know my dreams are so vivid and so detailed why does a big dutty cockroach crawl out of this box? I'm horrified, horrified. That's a story for another time on why I'm horrified about pests of any kind. But well, I mean, who doesn't hate cockroaches? So point of the story is before I go on a random tangent is that I was so disturbed that I woke up. But when I woke up, I was like, wait, my vision was good enough in my dream to see the cockroach and I could see the colors on it. Ew, it's making me crawl the thought of it. But after that, I was like, oh, this is the first time since I've been diagnosed that I had a dream where my vision was back to what it was. Because anytime I've dreamt since I've been losing vision, whatever my vision is when I'm awake is what it is when I'm asleep, which sucks because you feel like if you're dreaming, you can dream that you can see well again. No, 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 not me. In my dreams, I'm as blind as I am during the day and it's so annoying because sometimes I'll literally be dreaming and be like, girl, you can't even read a book in your dreams. You can't even imagine that. I'm waiting for my computer to load because I locked myself out. Cap locks was on. I did that. about to rain so i mean the humidity is level high out there and while i was walking back some guy was like this towards me i don't know what that was about but then i looked men in toronto sometimes do the most like i don't know i do not know okay well this isn't that because of course it's just gonna set up tomorrow but i just wanted to at least put these here like so let's go back upstairs to be home again i am so grateful you don't even know <gasps> What an adventure! As you know, every vlog, I complain about my hair. I made an effort to not complain this far. But look, I had this shower cap since I was a teen. And I don't know if it's hot there or it's just because I had it forever. But look, I handed this to my brother and he's like, this is disgusting. I can be really extra and put my head in the water. Ooh, wow. Okay, that's the type of time we're on. <laughs> Well, I mean, I've had these since I was 17. I had a water bottle at the bottom of my bag. 
and it destroyed my book. My brother tried to blow dry it for me. He did a good job, but I mean, <sighs> to wish you guys a good morning, but I hope that your day is going well. Mine is swell, it's so hot in here, which is why that fan has been on since last night. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. Oh, that feeling sucks. But yeah, I'm gonna have some lunch right now. Eat it really quick, because I don't wanna use up too much of my lunch break. I threw on this dress because I wanna film a video, or at least half of one, before my meeting this afternoon. And then we're gonna go for a nice walk with my friends, hopefully to one of the local parks. Probably can't even see this from here, but I've been trying to download this all day. Literally all day. I'm gonna go back to what I was doing because, yeah, no. Froth my oat milk. I added a little bit of coconut syrup and then I put my highest grade of matcha. I find when you make ice matcha, you want the most flavor possible. That coconut syrup though, I ordered it a couple of months ago from Amazon at first. I was just like, what a waste, Alicia. I know you love coconut, but what a waste. This is a thing dreams are made of. And I think it was only $13 if I remember right. I believe in the last two months of not ordering Starbucks other than that one time, I saved $60. Yeah, I'm gonna keep making my own drinks over here. Remember that building I showed you in the last vlog? It's gone already, that's crazy. I love it here. I see so many expenditures. It is so fucking nice here. I've never been here. Yeah, that's why I said you have to walk on the bridge. This is the part I was saying. It's so nice. Oh, I see you. Oh, wow, now he's yours. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hello. So excited for life. Hello. Oh, wow. <laughs> That was such a nice walk. Three hours later, we always go on adventures like that. I don't usually wash my hands in the kitchen, but I'm hungry. Let me just make sense to at least take off my backpack. The door of the Explorer has arrived. I'm gonna make some, I feel like chicken tonight. I feel like chicken tonight. Chicken tikka? Or maybe I'll make butter chicken, I don't know. It ain't Indian without basmati. Better than putting a frozen pizza in the oven, right? See, there I go. Remember our last time I said I say oven instead of oven? I'm sorry. But basically, my meal of the evening is some cauliflower and butter chicken. The cauliflower is not as tender as I like it to be, but the chicken, Sleepy lychee, I'm fresh and clean, face feels so soft. All of that I did to unwind, I'm gonna undo by watching The Handmaid's Tale now. Depending on how traumatic it is, I may have to meditate after. Oh shoot, I forgot. I gotta edit a little bit. Let me not get ahead of myself, but it's already 10 o'clock. So I'm gonna edit for half an hour max so that I'm in bed by 11.30. Almost in an extra unnecessary kind of party and just like, um, um, specifically- I love Lawrence. I need your help. Reverse. Pools open and it's a 10 person max. I count uno, dos, tres. I think someone's swimming. Do you see? Can you see behind me? This is absolutely insane. So many people have been feeding to go out that they're lining up for the smallest patio of life. But I'm probably gonna have to wash them again because synchronicities say, where can I put this box? Not on my bed, that's for sure. 
just as I was coming in, I saw a call on my phone and I thought it was my friend calling me back because I tried to get, get him since I finished early today. I might as well go to the beach, but he's probably already there. What a ride. What a ride. My package from Aldo. So I don't know if I told you this during the vlog, but I decided, I can't even get into the story of why I decided, but just know that I'm not gonna be shopping anymore. So if you see anything, I ordered it from months before. One at a time. Bam. I got two shoes because it was either that or buy one for paid shipping, but then it's free return. So I thought I'm in between these two shoes Anyway, let me just see which one I prefer and send the other one back to the streets. I mean, although I have a type <laughs> So I got these I love the neutral tone. This is actually my new. It's nice too. Which one? I should do an Instagram poll. Last time I did like a shoe thing. I got so many DMs from foot fetish people Not looking for that. This one is way looser than I thought it'd be This one fits perfectly these ones are beautiful. They're half size smaller, but somehow I'm not about that flip-flop life. There's always got to be a strap at the back. Otherwise, I'm going to flip-flop my way to the pool of the beach and that's that. I don't go anywhere else with flip-flops. I just, I don't like the sound of it. Three, it's 346. I just finished filming my what in the world. And now I'm going to wash it off because I'm not trying to have it cook in my face and go down to the pool and get a little sun and hopefully even out from the time I wore the ripped jeans and now I have a dark patch. swimming because like I said I don't want to mess up my hair but to soak up the sun and listen to a good pod you know that's all this girl needs I'm gonna clean up my house a little bit look what happened I dropped it one too many times and now the last time was the last time for the last time glasses came in a box like this she showed me that somebody else also got a box i also got some tea so let's open this first zoom in with my phone but i'm using my phone right now so this one should be coconut matcha be wild honey matcha some kind of matcha but i don't remember oh i think it's cherry blossom more matcha but i don't know what kind this is so i'll zoom in and show you love the teas Dun, 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 I'm off key. That's, that's not working. For the feature presentation. Oh my God, I'm so reckless. Virtual try on, I have to hold my, my phone back, but I can't see that far. Cause if you've seen me, I use my phone like this. So I had to take a screenshot of the virtual try on in order to see what it looks like. So I haven't seen these yet. You're going to see them. Ooh. I like the way that it opens. Okay, Warby Parker, I see you. And Lauren was the associate that helped me. The fact that I remember her name a month later lets you know how kind she was. Yes, I did think they were gonna be bigger though. I wanted them to be like Harry Potter status, but maybe this is a good thing for my face. It feels small. Whoa! <laughs> okay, clearly these are way stronger. What the hell is going on? giving me a headache instantly. Mattress last year said they weren't far off from these ones. It's like a shot of tequila to the eyes. What the hell is that? Meanwhile, this one, yes, I noticed there's a slight difference, not enough to say anything, but this is like a kaleidoscope dream. What the hell? The prisms are so strong in this. I just hope that when I use this, I make less mistakes at work. I'm quicker at editing. Yo, this is literally my left eye can't deal. I don't know how to feel. I'm so self-conscious right now. I know I wear the slitty ones. I call them slitty because they're so slim from time to time, but this is different. I almost wish they were bigger, which is exactly the opposite of what I just said, but I wanted them to be big and round. Kind of like, you know, when you see little kids and their glasses are too big, that makes it so cute. The frames. They'll grow on me. I don't think it's worth sending back, but dang, this is crazy. 
Oh, I wish I could play tennis. I've been walking for about a half an hour. I was hoping that I would get adjusted by now. Not so much, but maybe I just need to wear it for the rest of the night and all of tomorrow and then I'll adjust. I can tell that I'm using my left eye more, but I said that before. Anyways, when I did the whole test to get the prescription, all I could see was the E, which is the biggest letter on the chart. So I didn't expect this to be a miracle worker. This looks a little creepy at this time of day. I don't know how deep I want to go in here. I think the exit's right here though, so I should be okay. I love cilantro. Can never have enough cilantro. Tonight's dinner is a veggie bowl with quinoa topped with cilantro and avocado. I still have that Megan the Stallion song in my head from this morning. It's a bop. On the bright side, it's been a couple hours and now my eyes have finally adjusted. Everything is a little bigger, but nothing's really clearer. Hey loves, happy Saturday. So I'm just at the beach. It's hot, but I'm here for it. You know, the hotter the better. I would be happier if it were like 33 or 43 instead of 23, but we're still working it out over here. My friends just went to go take a dip. End of the day. Isn't it so peaceful here? 